Well, as you are thinking about those summer travel plans or maybe just being outdoors a little more often, do you have clothes that say they offer sun protection? Brenda Lewis from our National Verified team looked into the difference between wearing those and actually putting sunscreen on your skin. You already know it's important to lather up on sunscreen, but what about clothing claiming to also help protect you from the sun's damaging ultraviolet rays? One Verify viewer saw labels saying it has a UPF, or ultraviolet protection factor, and texted us to see if this means the same thing as SPF, which is used to measure sunscreen's effectiveness. So, let's verify. Is there a difference between SPF and UPF? Our sources are the Skin Cancer Foundation, the American Academy of Dermatology, and Dr. Adam Friedman, Chair of Dermatology at George Washington University School of Medicine and Health Sciences. SPF and UPF can help you determine how effective a product is at protecting you from the sun. SPF measures time, or how long sunscreen works at blocking the sun, and UPF measures how much of the sun's rays are blocked by a fabric. For example, under ideal conditions, an SPF 30 sunscreen will help keep your skin from burning 30 times longer than it would without any sunscreen. An article of clothing with a UPF of 30 means the fabric blocks around 97% of the sun's rays from reaching your skin. Our sources recommend using at least an SPF 30 sunscreen and UPF 30 clothing. There's no one way to fully protect yourself from the sun. I think you wanna take a combination approach. So that includes using sunscreen SPF 30 or higher and clothing to protect the exposed areas. So yes, there is a difference between SPF and UPF. All fabric has some sort of protection from the sun, even if it doesn't have a UPF rating. And in general, dark or brightly colored clothing is more effective. With your Verify, I'm Brandon Lewis.